Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. How's everybody doing? Hopefully you're doing pretty good. Hopefully. Somebody's got to be doing good. <laughs> no, I'm doing alright. I'm doing alright, just... Life has been extremely hectic. Like, extremely. It's unbelievable how much time and stress and energy and just oh too much so I haven't really had chance to well I shouldn't say chance I haven't really had the motivation to sit down for any long period of time and record um, I have recorded little bits and clips as I did stuff or discovered stuff um, you know, things like this one right here. Hwa! In your face. Aw. You can't shoot in K mode? Dang. Oh well. Um, so yeah. Awesome stuff like that shotgun. And a bunch of other stuff. all in those clips yep so today's going to be a little bit of a jumping around episode just showing what I've been doing uh, hopefully next episode will be a little bit more normal yeah so hopefully you guys enjoy it and here's some clips well this might not be the best idea but wait wait Stay back. But, found this little guy. Yeah, see, look, he's little. Yeah? Found this little Mosa. And figured, hey, I've, I've never had a Mosa. Let's try and shoot it. So, yeah. I'm shooting it. So far, so good. So far, so good. Oh, big mouth. Big mouth. Aha. I... I don't even know if I have enough tranquilizer arrows with me for this. We can hope. We can hope. Nope. Ah! Ow! Ow, ow, ow. Oh, there goes my scuba mask. And the fight continues. In the face. In the face. Yep. Good thing I don't need that scuba mask to be able to breathe. Doing okay. Plugging away. Plugging away. It's really not that exciting. I mean, it is, but it isn't. Like, it's exciting because, like, I could die at any minute, but it's not so exciting for filming because this is taking forever. This is taking forever. Ha! You missed me. You missed can't even chew properly. Jeepers. Oh man, he is starting to get really bloody. Like, I've been pegging at this guy for a while. Lost a couple more pieces of armor to a couple of hits, but like, he is getting bloody. What, how, how crappy would it be for him to die rather than get knocked unconscious? all this time <laughs> oi yeah come on turn around that's it yes come towards me I will be above you oh, ha, ha. sneaky sneaky come on Come on. Ooh. Oh. Oh, is that it? I think that's it. I think that's it. Okay. We're here. We've got our 10 Quetzal egg kibble. Should be enough to tame it. And it's been starved out. So, should hopefully just insta-tame. 
But first, some pre-tamed stats. We've got 8352 health, 960 stamina, 1482 weight, and 155 melee. It's not bad. So let's get this guy tamed up. And yeah. There he goes. He's a eating. He's a eating. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Chomp, 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 chomp. I don't know why I can't hear him chomping, but I guess it's because it's underwater. Hey, there it goes. I tamed a Mosa. Yes, I did. Mosa, sir. Level 104. Not bad. Not bad at all. I just need a saddle for him. I need a saddle for him. Yeah. That guy's got a big toothy grin. <laughs> big toothy grin. I like it. It's kind of a boring brown color, but I like it. So let's take him home. Let's get a saddle on him. What better way to test out a new Mosa than going after Ocean Drops? So here at 10.7.29.7, I've got myself a beacon. Let's see what's inside it. We have got a Journeyman Me Megaloceros Saddle Blueprint. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Here at 10.94. And it's a Mastercraft crossbow blueprint. Who? I will take that. That is very nice. Very nice indeed. So far, so good. I kind of heard something interesting today. And that's if you block off the, the beacon spawn locations with foundation or... Uh, I, I've heard also pillar with a ceiling piece will will do uh, it won't spawn at this location which means that you can actually kind of limit it to only spawn at certain locations that you pick and I think that's a pretty cool idea so I'm gonna try it all right well still just doing my circle of the island finally came across a drop Place down a couple foundation. Hopefully this will uh, prevent it from respawning here. Um, and check out what the loot is. Mastercraft, Mosasaur, Platform, Saddle. Very nice. So fishy here. From 25 armor to 68.2. Now, it is a platform, so it's kind of, you know... A little strange to have a big platform on them, but that's okay. I'll take it. <laughs> on to the next drop. Alrighty, next drop. What are we going to get? Well, first off, let's see about placing down some foundations. Oh, I thought I saw it go green. Oh, well, whatever. Let's get the beacon drop. It is a journeyman built... Bella's the buff, whatever, the frog saddle. Oh, it did go green right there. Aha. There. That should prevent it from spawning. In theory. In theory. Alrighty. Well, they should be all blocked off, except for two, which can't be blocked. And that's this one on top of the cave here at 10.640.3. But I'm not seeing it here. Which I would assume then means it spawned at one that's been blocked. Unless it does work and it's a matter of I've already found two and they just haven't respawned yet. 
I I don't know. So I kind of missed hit and record before I grabbed it. Oops. But check this out. We got ourselves a new saddle. A Mosasaur a Journeyman. 71.4 armor. That's better than the Mastercraft I already got. It's kind of weird, come to think of it, but I'll take it. My only issue is I really don't think that it's craftable. With that metal requirement, eh, it's probably too much for the smithy or a beaver, which is a little depressing. So apparently I didn't block this one well enough. It spawned. Anyway, so let's try the pillar and ceiling thing right at it. What's in it? Oh, oh, oh my. Ascendant pump action shotgun blueprint. Oh, wow. Look at this. Ascendant. 233 weapon damage and 984 durability. Wow. Just. Oh my. So, of course, I had to come straight home and craft this thing up. I'm just short a little bit of polymer. Oh, there it goes. But it didn't turn blue. Why didn't it turn blue? Oh, I think it's because it's using the cementing paste. Uh, uh, cancel, cancel. Aha! There we go. Now I can craft it. Jeepers. Look at all of that. It requires 1369 polymer. That's a lot. But I have it. So, let's craft it. <laughs> Oi. From full to empty. That's a lot of materials. But this is going to be one sweet shotgun. Hey, there it is. There's my new toy. Bam, baby. Ascendant pump action shotgun. Oh. Like, does it get better? No. No, it doesn't. Oh, I just, I can't get over it. I can't get over it. And of course, what's a new toy without going out for a play? Let's see. Oh, look at that. A T-Rex. Come here, Rexy boy. I want to test my shotgun on ya. Do, 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 do. Come here, come here. Bam! Bam! Oh, in the face. Oh! Ah! Crap. Water. Can't shoot in water. Can't shoot. Can't. Let, nope. Let me out. Can't shoot in water. Ah! There we go. That's not bad, actually. That was five shots. Five shots. All right. Then... You know, I mean, four polymer to repair it after five shots. That's that's a little pricey. It's going to get pricey. But I'll deal with it. Just for the sheer fun of it, I will deal with it. Hey, look, an anklo. Get some. Yeah, get some. Aha. Another anklo. Reload. Come on, other anklo. Bam. Aha. Nice. Two shot even for a level 20. Another anklo. Bam. Oh. Instant blood. Oh. Hello, Dodic. Bam. Yeah, little ball. Bam. Ooh. Kills a curled up Dodic. Oh, hello, Argy. Eh. Oh, come on. I apparently can't aim. There we go. Aha. Yeah, I am liking this. I am liking this new toy. Mm-hmm. Alrighty, back underwater. We apparently have a drop that I didn't block off so well. Oops. Oh well, I'll have to uh, see about blocking it better. So what do we got? What do we got? Ooh, Ascendant Quet Platform Saddle. 
Quet, Quets, Ascendant Quets platform saddle. 84.6 armor. No, I've seen better, but it's still pretty good. I'll probably swap that over on Pretzel, because she's kind of the one that uses the, uh, the platforms. So check this out. I found this 120 angler, and he's not moving. I'm hitting him. Not moving. He's bugged or something. Oh, oh and there he goes. Unconsciousness. Yay! 120 angler. I mean, okay, it's an anglerfish, but hey, that's pretty cool. Still, it's 120, so I'm going to need prime meat. But I think first what might be a good idea, get my coordinates so I can remember where it is. And then we'll go get prime meat. Sounds like a plan. Prime meat achieved. Almost tamed, too. So shouldn't be too long. I think there's only eight points of hunger left. So quick rundown. 2610 health, 140 attack, 696 stamina, 476 weight. All right. I mean, it's an angler. I, I can't really expect miracles. So, yeah, here we go. Perfect tame, 120 angler. Ta-da! All righty. Hi there. Hi. You are very green. You are green. I know what I'm going to call you. I do indeed. We are going to call you Green Bean. Because you're green. Aha. It's Green Bean. I think I'm going to ride him home. <laughs> Oops. Silly me. I forgot post-tame stats. So... 350-10 health, 960 stamina, 525 weight, and 221 melee damage. It improved. <laughs> no, it's, it's, it's pretty good. Alright. Well, what did you guys think? I think it was pretty cool, hey? Getting an Ascendant shotgun. Oh! Oh! I'm like, oh no, I was just going to have a chance to test it. But no, it's just dev. Um, yeah, Ascendant Shotgun. Mastercraft Sword. Even got a Mastercraft Pickaxe now. Uh, that was actually uh, dev who gave that to me. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yay. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. Hopefully, you know, the whole clip thing wasn't too bad. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, leave me a like. Give me a comment. Let me know what you thought. And come back for next time.